go onto your internet access point. So that's either Safari, Google, or Microsoft Bing, or whatever you use. Um, and then you're going to type just giving into the search engine. Um, go on to online fundraising donations and ideas. So it comes to the front uh, main page uh, of just giving. You click on to start fundraising and you'll get to this page. So what you need to do there is you need to click a charity and then you need to click sign up if you've not got an account with just giving if you do then you can just log in um, but if you can sign up um, then you just need to do your first name last name email address and create a password and then just sign up and then the next process here is putting your postcode in and your address um, and then it'll come up like this so I'll put my password in Okay, so then it will pop up like this. So the next step is to search Ashgate Hospice in the search engine here, and then it'll come up with campaigns. Now, the campaign that we want is Ashgate Hospice Sparkle Nightwalk 2023. So you have to click that button. You've got to keep scrolling. Um, until you get to this one. So it's Sparkle, it's with Techniques logo on it, and we select it like that. Now on the phone, it will be a circle with a little arrow on it, um, but I'll show you that in a different video. Um, so the first thing, it will come up with this. Uh, you can do it in memory of someone, so you can write their name, the relationship to you. You can also change um, the name of your fundraising page. And then you just need to click, yes, please, opt me in. So I'm not doing it in memory of anyone. So I'll just create my page. And then what you'll first get is your page is ready. So you can give yourself the first donation. Now, this means that you can put uh, an amount in um, to say that, yeah, you've donated, I don't know, a fiver or 20 or however much you want to donate to yourself for doing it. Um, people are more likely to give um, money when you they see other people do it. So just by getting the first um, donation through, it just makes it so much easier for yourself. Um, so that's that first. Um, but you can do it later if you'd like with the um, Give Now button here. So I'll just say, not now, maybe later. And then this is the page, that's what it's going to look like. Um, so it's going to have your name and that you're taking part in it. Um, and it's got a bit for your uh, story as well. Um, so it'll have, so people can give now here. And also you can edit your page to make it more personal to you. So what you'll do is you'll click edit page. You can change your fundraising target to uh, however much you want to target yourself. Um, we're asking um, for £80 um, for like a sponsorship. Um, it's not a minimum donation um, fee, but we're just asking everyone if that's uh, a possibility. Because if uh, 2,500 people um, fundraise £80, we could um, fundraise over £200,000. So it is very much worth it. Um, but if you do it as like, I don't know, a team, so you can do five times 80 or whatever you can um, try and do, but you can put a target just there. Um, and then you can do a page summary. So you're walking for um, and why you're doing it for them. Um, and then you've got, you can put if anyone else is involved in doing it. So you can add them to your page, um, like just to say that you're doing it with them. And then you can add your bit to your story to say why you're doing it for, if you've got a special reason, or if you're just doing it with your mates, it's absolutely fine. You can do, you can say whatever you'd like. And then what you wanna do is you wanna go into media 
and this is your page cover so you can have this or you can change your cover to something that you've created and then you can also add a photo to your gallery so if that's a, a loved one um, or your team and um, you can add it there and you can also add a caption in as well so after you select the photo you just need to click upload and the photo will upload uh, okay and it will come up here underneath the cover photo that we um, just standardized for everyone's page um, so that's sorted there and then what you want to do is you can go on donations so this is where you can add offline donations. So if you've got any cash or you sponsorship form or anything like that, we want to know. So we'd love for you to add in any offline donations here. And then that way, your team amount will be as accurate as possible or your individual amount will be as accurate as possible. Um, still bring in the money um, either to our fundraising hub in Hasland um, behind the furniture shop or you can come in to our um, Ashgate Hospice um, hub in the hospice itself um, and also we'll be having t-shirt collections where you can drop your money off there as well um, but the deadline is two weeks after Sparkle. If you can make that, that would be great. Um, and then you've got settings. So at any point, so you can extend your page if you want to, um, but the standard is the 1st of January. Um, you can write a little thank you message that will send to anyone who is making a lovely donation. Um, so you can say that, you know, my, my mum was cared at the hospice and now this money can go towards people who were cared for like my mum or anything like that just make it really lovely and personal just to make sure that those people who are donating just really really feel the uh, benefit of doing that um, and then you've got a QR code here so what you can use here is you can add this to any poster that we have on our fundraising um, resource page on our website and you can add this and then wherever you go if people scan it they can add, they can donate to your page. And then what you want to do, if you're in a team, so if you're in, if you're not doing it on your own or fundraising on your own and you're doing it in a pair or two plus, what you want to do is you want to click here, start a team. You want to enter your team name. So I'm going to do Ashgate Sparklers. Okay. And then you click let's go. So it's going to load. And then what you want to do is you want to say continue. So your story, so you can do a team photo or the team story. So it could be for your colleague, for your best friend. It could be for anyone. And then you press continue. And then you've got a fundraising target for your whole team that's on the page. And then you want to call it Ashgate Sparklers. I've already done one practice on so I'll just put a one there and then you create your team so then this is the team page okay so the captain who does this who creates the team then needs to invite members so what you can do is you can send it via a link to whatsapp or messenger into your group chat or you can copy the link and text it over to someone and you can do this at any point um, in your just giving so if you have team members now that you can add amazing but if you don't know if anyone's gonna come or they don't know yet because of a holiday or a family commitment they can be added to later okay so then go to my team page so this will look like this and it'll have your little total and your target there and things like that and also if anyone you don't have to be a part of the team like list of the team um you can people can join it themselves so they can join the team here and they just need to join the team so you, you can either connect to the fundraising page if you already have a page or you can create your own fundraising page here which is exactly what we've just done so you just have to connect your fundraising page okay um and then so we'll just go back because I don't need to do that myself. Um, so yeah, so here's where all the supporters will come in. So everyone who's put a donation through will pop up here. 
Um, and then here you'll have all of your team members in this bit here. And then this will be the team captain. So at the moment it's me, but it can be anyone in your team. And then it will be a bit of spiel about the campaign. It will come up with total raised amount, but also all of the online donations on Just Giving will be here. And all of the offline donations that I mentioned earlier, any cash, checks or anything like that that you want to add to your total can be put here. OK, so this year um, we're doing team leaderboards. So we'll have a friends and family um, leaderboard and we'll have a workplace one and an education one for like nurseries, schools and things like that. Um, so if you have a specific category you would like to be put in, then please let us know at events at ashgatehospice.org.uk and you can just email Leah Moore um, on that. And also um, with that, we can just tie people together um, with that one as well. So if you don't know who's in your teams or who's registered yet, you can just pop, uh, give us a call and we will try and help you as much as possible um, with that as well.